In this video, we're going to do some extension questions on quadratic functions. We're asked to complete the square for each expression, writing our final answer in the form k multiplied by the quantity x plus a all squared plus b. So let's start with a. We've got x squared over 2 plus 4x. If I'm completing the square, I want the coefficient of the term in x squared to be 1. So all I'm going to do here is factor out 1 half. So I'll take 1 half out. That's going to leave me now x squared plus 8x. At this stage, I'm going to complete the square on the expression inside the brackets. So we're going to have 1 half. Completing the square, I take x plus half the coefficient, which will be x plus 4. I square the bracket and then subtract away 4 squared. So it'll be x plus 4, all squared, minus 16. All I need to do now is multiply back through by the 1 half. So we'll have 1 half the quantity x plus 4 all squared minus 1 half times by 16, which is going to give me now minus 8. So we can see in this particular case, k is going to be equal to 1 half. We've got a will be positive 4, and we've got now b is going to be minus 8. So we've completed the square first by taking out the fact of 1 half, completing the square with in the bracket and then multiplying back through. So with this one I'm going to take out in b a factor of 3 quarters. So if I do that I'm going to have 3 quarters. I'll have now x squared and if I divide minus 2 by 3 quarters I'm going to have minus 8 over 3. So I'll have minus 8 over 3x. At this stage I'm going to complete the square inside the brackets. So 3 quarters on the outside I need x plus half a coefficient. So this will be x minus 4 over 3. We need to square the bracket. Then I'm going to subtract away 4 over 3 squared. So that will be minus 16 over 9. I'm now going to multiply back through by 3 quarters. So we'll have 3 quarters multiplied now by the quantity x minus 4 over 3 all squared minus if I do 3 quarters multiplied by 16 ninths, the 3 and the 9 will cancel to 1 over 3. 16 over 4 is going to give me 4, so we end up now with minus 4 over 3. So in this particular case now, we have k will be equal to 3 quarters. We've got a now to be minus 4 thirds, so a will be equal to minus 4 thirds. And we've got now the value of b also to be minus 4 thirds. So we've completed the square initially by taking out the factor of 3 quarters. We complete the square within the bracket and then multiply through. 